Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. On the 16th of May, Monday, we're looking at the Dow uh, down 173 points at 32,022. It really needs to get above the high off Friday. That was at 32,276. It needs to get to the 32,300s. It needs to do that pretty soon. I would say by Tuesday afternoon, Monday, uh, Tuesday afternoon, Wednesday, without breaking under, say, 31,800. Uh, this point, so we're looking at the S&P also down. Did try to rally some. S&P is down 34 at 3989, without taking out the 3982, 3978 level support. Now we're looking at 4039 is really an upside target in the next two days. It's going to take a lot of work to do that. Looking at the QQQ. I think the Qs need to be participating with the Dow to move to the upside. The S&P and the IWM can follow. I think this is the way I'm looking at it right now. But the, the Qs are down uh, 4.30 at 297.52. This is the Invesco QQQ Trust Series. These are the NDX stocks that need to rally right now. As I'm talking, hey, are you listening? So we're looking at IWM, the Russell 2000, down 93 at uh, 177. Yeah, this also needs to move higher. It needs to get to the 181 area by, by Wednesday or Thursday. You're looking at gold was unchanged a little earlier. Now it is up four. This is a good opportunity for gold maybe to move. We'll see if the dollar is going to pull back from this peak F potential. 105.01, the high that was made on Friday. Watching it closely. It doesn't have to pull back much, but it could maybe digest some of those gains. Crude oil. Crude oil is acting quite nicely here. It's up 79 cents. At 100. Well, it depends on what, which side you're on. 111.26. Nobody really wants to see uh, oil screaming much higher. But there's a very quick weekly peak A, peak B, and leg C within the rectangle. So all I can say is if, if crude oil this week closes over 116, something else is happening in that whole oil sector. That's going to be serious stuff. Looking at the TLT bonds, I didn't even talk about it much in my show, The Tiger Technicians Hour, a few minutes ago, at 116.63. Um, let's see. It, will crude oil break 116 on the upside, or will TLT break 116 and go to 120 so that yields can come down? Big question here. Meantime, back at the ranch, the VIX index, the volatility index, trading at uh, down again. Oh, it's unchanged at 28.87. If for any reason it starts to break underneath 28 today, as the Dow and the S&P try to get stronger, that'll give a nice close to the day. That's kind of what you want if you're bullish in the short term. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned for Larry Presidente. Larry has his workshop coming up tomorrow. Check out that front page with the Infinite. Most opportune time to have it. It should be fantastic. All right. Take care.